welcome back to my channel today i'm going to show you how to make um coconut fufu this is um the shaft or the plump from coconut that i sieved the coconut milk out of but normally here we get coconut flour you can get coconut flour like this it has the coconut um It has the coconut uh, milk and things inside. I don't really know, but we get it like this. So I make it with this one. But anytime I make coconut milk and I get the the plump from it, the shaft, I use it too to make my coconut um, fufu. So what I do is I add. Uh, Add my coconut flour, add some water, and then I add my psyllium husk. I like adding my psyllium husk immediately. I add the water, I'm using one teaspoon. I like adding it immediately. I add my, my water before I start. Um, cooking it properly because I noticed that psyllium husk dissolves better in cold water than it does in hot water when you put it when it is hot you might run the risk of it clumping up so as I'm making it now I am turning it with the psyllium husk and everything If it's too thick you can add a little bit more water but it's better you start with small quantity of water and add as you go you can add more water but you can't take out water so it's better you add water as you go along Most times you don't want you don't um you don't use too much um uh, psyllium husk because a little goes a long way. And this is like a fufu. I will use I will eat twice. So I could just say for one uh, meal for me, I'm using half a teaspoon of psyllium husk for it it's still gonna when it cools it's still gonna harden some more so you need to have it light when you make it at first So whether you use the coconut shaft or you use the coconut flour the way it is, it's still the same thing. You're still going to get something like this. So I'm using this because it is available. I would rather use this first before I use the flour because this one as it is now has more fiber. And I think uh, in keto diet, you need fiber because you hear people complaining of constipation and things like this it is from foods like this that you take in your fiber from your vegetables see 
looks like from the DM. Wow, it really does look like from the DM. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. It looks, it feels more like semu than it does yam. But it's, you can add uh, your sedum husk a bit more if you want it to stretch further. But I think this one is okay. 